everybody, it's me, Max. I am so glad you are joining me for story time. There is a cool prize at the end of the video, so stick around. I am very excited to find out what book we are reading today. So let's find out with Mr. Narrator. Take it away. Today's story time storybook of the day is Bear Feels Sick by Karma Wilson with illustrations by Jane Chapman. Alone in his cave as the autumn wind blows, Bear feels achy with a stuffed up nose. He tosses and he turns, all huddled in a heap. Bear feels tired, but he just can't sleep. He sniffs and he sneezes, he whiffs and he wheezes, and the bear feels sick. His friends gather round. Come out, bear, and play. Bear shakes his head. I'm too sick today. Mouse mutters, oh my, bear's head is too hot. Hare says, we will help. Here's a warm, cozy spot. Bear mumbles and he moans. He grumbles and he groans. And the bear feels sick. Mouse squeezes Bear tight, he whispers in his ear, It'll be just fine, your friends are all here. Badger fetches water, Gopher cooks the broth, while Mole soothes Bear with a cool wet cloth. They cover Bear up and he drinks from a cup, but he still feels sick. Raven says, Ka! Come along, Owl and Wren. Let us go gather herbs to bring back to the den. They coax Bear to sip just a smidgen of tea. You'll feel better soon, says Mouse. Wait and see. Bear shakes and he shivers. He coughs and he quivers. And he still feels sick. The friends fuss and fret, the friends cook and care. They keep a close eye on their poor sick bear. They all talk in whispers, they walk on tippy toes. They sing lullabies, then the bear starts to doze. They watch bear for hours, we've done all we could. Then the bear wakes up, and the bear feels good. Bear cries, I'm all better. I'm feeling like new. I'm not hot and achy. It's all thanks to you. Let's celebrate now. Let's go out and play. Let's jump in the leaves. Let's frolic all day. Then Mouse starts to wheeze, and Hare starts to sneeze, and the friends feel sick. Bear murmurs, don't worry, and tucks them in bed. He bundles them up, and he kisses each head. He tells all of his friends, you'll soon feel like new. You took care of me, now I'll take care of you. The end. I hope you enjoyed the story. Now back to Max. Great job finishing the book. What did you think about it? Great. I like this book because it really shows that Bear's friends really took care of him when he wasn't feeling good. When Bear was sick, they all got together and they helped him so much. And then when he felt better and they started to feel sick, he was willing to do the exact same thing for them. And that's a very good friend. You did an awesome job reading the whole book. So, here is your prize. Mm -hmm. 
that is some awesome dancing. Well, until next time, bye everyone, and be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the like button for this video. Bye!